all seems to start with this box that pops up when it says if you have a Windows Live ID sign in now if not you can create one later sign in to Windows Live then it says get a Windows Live email address this box you if you already have an email address with another host or another provider you can put that one in here and your password to that provider Okay, Project Baloney here. I'm going to show you how to set up your Windows Live Mail without having a Windows Live ID. So we're going to go to the Start button on the left, All Programs, Windows Live Mail. We're going to let the client come up. On the left hand side towards the top, there's a Settings drop down. Go to Options, Email Accounts. We're going to add an email account. So we're going to type in our necessary information for wherever our email is hosted. We're going to manually configure our server settings. set up so if you think you need to adjust the account a little bit more just click on the account go to properties you can change these names what you see the email address one of the things that you want to make sure and change is in the advanced leave a copy of messages on the server if you don't have that checked then this will download all of your messages and you won't be able to uh, get them anywhere else such as your phone your other desktop your tablet whichever and you can set these as as you wish so I'm gonna go ahead and close that we're gonna press send and receive and see what happens looks like we're we're getting it